Yo guys, what's up? Welcome to a new video on this channel. Today I will show you how to make a scoreboard on Creative Plus. And guys, so don't forget to leave a like, subscribe this channel and active the notify bell. You won't missing any content here. So and it will notify you every single basics of this coding. Alright guys, let's get started directly. Um, let's join the world I made for this. Now first of all we are doing is we have a diamond block and we are putting at the first line right click on it then world instructions then player join the game event so everything that is in the line if player joins it will be executed so then the next block we need is the game action so we get we have the game action what is actually doing is if player joins the rule game not personally the one player actually everyone in the game now we are doing score manipulation create scoreboard side by we create a scoreboard like this here and yes we are actually already finished but this here i will show you later so then we are going to the next line doing again the diamond block and doing combat then the skull that says play kill player event it's uh, the sentence already says what happened kills a player then something will happen so then we are actually need the set variable right click on it then do the slime ball it says numbers then to the white powder it says incredible variable it says also set variable and now we are doing dynamic variable what we are writing here is percent player percent under dash kills so that needs to be equal like this uh, diamond block here we're putting this here and the next is number we are um, writing one um, each per kill one point for every each player that kills the player here so and uh, the next step is game actions right click on it and choose scoreboard manipulation then set scoreboard score you can see here is this this is the string this is just the name and here is the dynamic variable we are for example doing 20 a string string is 20 and the second uh, slot is person player person yes that that's it then this here is dynamic variable we are put put this here at the first slot now the last step is just a cobblestone player action then we sneak down right click on it and all players then right click again on it then we choose the end value say settings then here shows source scoreboard sidebar first of all we put here is the string we have string 20 for example and what should be up here like it says player game here above and we have to put this also like don't know for example we need killer board board killer board all right right click on it and paste here and here we already did it also and here is just the string again so now the code is finished it's pretty short so guys now what we are doing is the last step we are doing here player kills play event if you want the scoreboard is saving every time you join the world or restart the world sneak down right click on the, it and it says save you can see under the it's, it's purple it it says save i mean pink and here is not it says not save we need to sneak down again sneak down it says again save paste here now we are finished while the next thing is we are just testing the game all right now we are can someone join the world for test question mark at dot this 
guy is actually lagging. Oh, it says four points because I tested before and it saved. So I need to repractice it. Um, he makes a lot of damage. Oh, he got one kill at the scoreboard. Now he needs to. He, he needs. To Oh, is he actually hacking or what is he doing? Oh, he has two kills. Um, I kill it this. I kill it this guy here. Yeah, guys. Uh, if you like this uh, content, please let me know where you need help, and I will help you too. Yeah, do you have a problem? And I try to find out and fix it for you. So, guys. Subscribe this channel, leave a like and see ya guys.